What's up guys and welcome back to Pool Rats. That's right, if you guys didn't notice, we have already changed our channel name instead of Beyond Family. Now we are the Pool Rats. Just kidding, we did not do that. But it seems like every day we have a rat in our pool. So today we're gonna take you out first thing and show you a rat in our pool. Madison, what do you got gloves on your hands for? She's a cat kitty. All right, she's being a kitty. All right, I don't know if you guys know, but we used to have a video up called Madison Hates Band-Aids. If you search for it, it's no longer there because Madison was dressed up as a kitty. She got her hands, or no, her toe got scratched. She was bleeding, and so we put a Band-Aid on, and she cried when we put a Band-Aid on because she was two, and she was scared of a Band-Aid. Anyways, YouTube thought that was bad that we were putting a Band-Aid on her kid, so they took it down. Anyways, we have another little baby mouse over there. Look at that. He is trying to stay on that hose because the filter is going now, so we got our little hose that's moving around, making it hard to stand on. So, once again, we gotta get a mouse out of her pool. Hopefully, we don't have to like show this every day. <laughs> it seems like this is like our kind of our morning routine is we come outside and we get a mouse out of the pool or else we clean up guts off the side of a pool from when a crow cleans out the rats. Anyways, Trin, I need you to get off of there and hold this so I can get it out. Okay, you're the Kay. camera girl. Hi! Hello! You want shivery? Did you know that that little guy's a baby? No, he didn't. Okay. That's our rescue today. Yeah. Okay. A little mouse trap you. Ready? And. <laughs> <laughs> we got him! You guys, I'm getting good at catching these things. One other thing I noticed over there bunnies are really cute, but like, man, they poop everywhere. Everywhere over to get this net. There's poop. Alright, guys, so today we're not gonna let the girls keep this little guy as their pet for the day and then let it go. We're just gonna let it go because we're not gonna keep it. Okay. Yeah, because... Do you need to show the rat? Yeah. The mouse? Little All right. Look at that. He's like, let me out. I want to go free. Come on, let's go. Let's take him to the back of the property and let him go so he can run up in the hill and play. Come on, let's go, little guy. All right. Here we go. Little mouse dude, you can go out now. You can go. Okay. Here. Go out, mouse dude. Here, I'm going to let you out. Go out, Prancer. Okay. His name is Prancer. Come on. No, he's trying to stay in the net. Prancer. Prancer. Right. Bye bye, Prancer. Okay, Prancer, you gotta go. Yeah. All right, guys. Meet little Prancer. That plant's not big enough for you, bud. Aww. There he goes. He's gonna prance away. He's prancing away. He's like walking weird. All right, so that's our little pet Prancer mouse for the day. We let him go. Prancer. Yay! All right, there's one critter that we have saved from the pool. All right, let's go inside and see what mom's up to. Look who just woke up from his nap. Can you say hi, Preston? Hello. What are we today? The Flash? No, not Flash. Um, Iron Man? I don't know. Anyway, we're trying to do some sleep training with Preston. He has not been sleeping good ever since he got his eighth tooth in. His sleep schedule has been way off, so we're struggling to get him back on a good routine, but he just took a good nap. Um, and I just, while he was napping, I finished cleaning this guinea pig cage. Hi, chocolate. Alice, what are you doing? Trinity, help me clean the cage. So now they've got a squeaky clean home. So I always look out this window in the mornings um, when I get up with Preston, I'll walk down the hallway and look out. And I had actually seen that little critter out there in the pool. And so I had let, when I came upstairs to take Preston to bed, I let, um, Dad and the girls know, so they went outside and I guess they rescued it. But I'm looking out here now and it looks like Dad is out there working on some TikTok videos with the girls. And somewhere over here, there's Dad. Madison's over there eating lunch, I think. And this guy and I, I think we're gonna go outside and maybe put him in a stroller, go for a walk. So he can go outside and get some fresh air. Hopefully things start opening back up soon so that we can go to even like the movie theater or the trampoline park. There's another place they like to go to. It's like an indoor playground. It's got a giant slide, rock wall, um, obstacle course things, super fun. All right guys, we are outside now. Preston, look at you. He's getting so big. Should we go see what everybody's up to? What are you Mom, doing? When I was at the, Mom, when I was at the top on of that, Big waterfall, uh -huh. that's why I saw a dead rat in the pool. Not the one that we rescued. Not the one that you rescued? That We did rescue one, but he was limping. 
Oh no! But you rescued him? I'm playing Elsa. Why are you dressed up as Elsa? Because. We did a quick talk. Do you want to show me really quick? I did. Now it. Oh! <laughs> Alright, and girls, why is dad up there dancing on that pole? I know. What? He's putting on lights. Putting lights up? Yeah, see? Hey what? guys, you're putting on lights. Guys, guess what? What? This thing is so tight because it turns when she was like three. Three, yeah. three years old. Guys. Well, it looks good on you, girl. Let's see the dead rat. Alright. Oh. No one's a fan of rats. Oh no. We rescued a rat and then we have a dead one. Oh, poor little guy. Sometimes you can't save them all, can you? Yeah. No. Nope. All right, guys. It looks like Dad might be getting the rat out of the pool. All right, so I got the dead rat out of the pool because I had to get the net anyways because when I was screwing in the lights and stuff up in the palapa, I dropped the Allen wrench and it's now at the bottom of the pool. So I tried to get it with the net, but I just can't get it with the net because it's so small. So I need someone like this one right here to dive down to the bottom of the pool and get an Allen wrench. What? Is it in the deep end? Yeah, and it's tiny. Is it teeny weeny? Teeny weeny, tiny. Um, I think you should have pulled out the pool sucker before. What? Oh, you came in here? Yeah, it's gonna suck it up and stop working. I don't think the pool cleaner is gonna suck it up because it's heavy and metal and I don't think it's going to, but maybe. So I guess we better hurry up and get our swimming suits on and get outside and go swimming. Go, go, go. You ready, bud? Yeah. All right, guys, so dad is over here rescuing a baby hummingbird. Let's see if he was able to get it or not. All right, guys, so we found a little baby hummingbird that fell out of its nest. Can't really fly yet, so. Hi, baby. Can you see it? Look at that guy. He's Hi, so small. Baby. All right. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and see if we can put him in this nest up here that there are no longer any hummingbirds in, and see if maybe he'll hang out there until he can fly. You no, know um, some birds do to um to teach their babies how to fly. They push them off of the nest. Oh, really? Uh huh. Go on, baby birdie. Oh, watch out! Flying away. Here you go. He's up on top of our palapa. You see him? Yeah, we're on the can you? He's right on the edge of our palapa, but we don't want him falling in the pool. Look at this guy. Look how he is so tiny. It's super hard to see him. Maybe he can fly, but I don't know. All right, guys, we're gonna stay out here by the pool. Just make sure he doesn't fall in or anything. I think he might be able to fly, but he can't make it very far. So we're gonna just stay out here. We're gonna get my tools so I can work on the lights over there, and we'll just keep an eye out for the baby bird. He's over here. I think it's the same one. Oh, he's doing pretty good. Oh, oh. oh there's a couple of them over there. And then they just flew off over there. All right, so apparently baby birds are starting to fly today because I saw like three of them over there and our little one's still up on the tree, up on the palapa. Are they still over here, Trin? There's one. And then another. Oh, this is the same one. Right there. There's our little hummingbird. Oh, All right, guys, let's go swimming. All right, guys, we found the hummingbird or a hummingbird. It is in the pool. Oh, baby. Okay. Let's see if we can get him back in his nest. We were just getting ready to do a TikTok over here. Oh. Over and found it. Before I thought it was like some leaves in the pool, but then I'm like, that's just leaves. Yeah, those aren't leaves. And then I came walking over oh. and then I saw its wings flutter like. And then like I saw this little baby. All right, little baby bird. Hey, baby. Like it makes me just want to cry. Like that's yeah. my only hope is that it doesn't go in the pool. Maybe just want to see him for a bit and then okay. come back. Oh. It's probably a little cold after his bath. All right, I'm going to go clean. try putting in a different nest over here that's a little bit lower down. All right. Got his eyes all closed. Guys, I just did oh, a okay. cannonball. Get out of the pool. <laughs> what? What? Oh! Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. What is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, it's under here. It's under your feet. Like, oh, it's what? No, it's right here. You're not. Oh, my God. It's under here. Uh. Oh, oh my gosh! Oh. Okay, now pull back out. Okay. <laughs> oh! Where's the net? Oh my gosh! Today is crazy. Oh, what? What? What's all the nets? I don't know. They're all by the basketball court, I think. Trin, you are swimming with a little rat. So today, Trinity actually was swimming with a rat. It was crazy. So I had a day to have a buddy in the pool with me, other than Madison and Dad and Mom and Preston. Oh my okay. gosh! Woo! Oh, he's gonna jump out. Mom, stop walking away. Ah. Look, guys, we got a rat. 
I mean, he's kind of cute. All right, I'm gonna take him back out back and let him go, and these girls can keep swimming. All right, Rat, you come in. Swimming in the pool, Rat Free. Guys, want to know what a water skipper is? A water yeah. skipper? He is right there. Water skipper's right there. You see the little bug, guys? He's You're alive right. to touch him. He's in our pool. We need to get him out. Put him in some other water. All right, Mathen, are you gonna jump in? Yeah. Okay. I already got my legs. Yeah. All right, jump in. Oh. Ooh, is it cold? Oh no, my floaty! Oh no, her floaty! All right, guys. Well, we didn't quite make it to the end of the property. He jumped off the net and then like he just oh, no. so somewhere there's a rat. <laughs> I guess we're gonna keep an eye out for some rats swimming in our pool, and hopefully nobody else is swimming with the rats. <laughs> we're a hummingbird. All right. Hey, Preston, you gotta go take a nap. All right, Betty, you ready for nap time? Huh? Let's go. Guys, I don't know if I got a rat bite or not because, like, this thing hurts really bad. I don't think the rat was bite you. All right, throw your goggles on. Okay, ready? Okay, swim down and get it. <laughs> There's another little diver. You get it? Yeah. All right, thanks, girl. Go have fun. All right guys, so the girls are swimming around chasing a water skipper uh, that we found in here. I'm gonna tell them there's another rat. Girls, hurry, there's a rat right there by you. Hurry, swim, 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 faster. Hurry, hurry, it's gonna, Madison, it's right by your tube. You know, you guys are slow. That rat would have eaten you. But I'm just kidding, there's no rat. What is it? There's no rat, I'm just kidding. You're a rat <laughs> All right, well the reaction wasn't quite as crazy as I thought it would be, but it was still pretty funny. All right guys, well the girls are still out swimming, but I was coming over here to check on Hummingbird, and it's gone. We had it sitting right there in the net, but it must have flown away, and we haven't seen from it or anything, so hopefully it's uh, got a little bit stronger wings and could make it home safely. Oh my gosh, guys, I totally almost stepped on Hummingbird. Um, it is right here. Little dude, come on. You can't go, okay? Look at this, this bird is so tiny, you guys. Come on, Hummingbird. What do we gotta do, huh? I don't know what to do guys, like seriously, look at the size of my finger and that bird. That is a teeny tiny little bird. But I don't know what to do with you. Look at that, it was like so cute you guys. Buddy! I seriously don't know what to do with this hummingbird you guys. We have to like, I don't know, get it to fly, but at the same time it can't be on the ground because when nighttime comes there's a lot of other critters that come running around here. So we have to figure out something to do with this hummingbird. All right, so I just called for mom, and she's letting baby cram such a sleep. All right, let me here. Okay, go ahead, let's walk out here, and I'll show you something. Okay? Okay. <gasps> exactly! I almost stepped on him. Seriously, he's right there. He's, yeah, he flew to there. So, what do we do with him? Like, seriously, he's like this big. I don't know what to do oh with him. Oh my goodness, little guy. Yeah. Hey. Hello, birdie. Hi, sweetie. I don't know what to do with him. What do we do with him? I don't know. I don't know, you guys. We gotta figure out something to do with this. Is he the one that we fished out of the pool? Yeah, he's the. Oh. Right there. All right, guys. Mm. We're gonna come up with an idea. We'll be back in a sec. All right, guys. So with some of our mini palms that they like to be in, I made kind of a nest just on one of the sides of the tree. I'll show you. So right here, I've just kind of got some of all this stuff that they make their nests out of. It's all kind of bunched around. So we're gonna see if we can put the birdie right here. All right guys, got the hummingbird in my little nest that I made for him. We're gonna keep an eye on him uh, the rest of the day. And if he's still in here tonight, we might put him in our little butterfly container just to make sure that nothing gets him overnight and then sick him out, I got here tomorrow, so. All right guys, so it looks like the little nest on there is going to work for this little baby bird. It seems pretty content. He's in there snuggled up and stuff. So we're gonna go ahead and call it a day. We're gonna go ahead and finish whatever we're doing for the rest of the day. All right guys, so I just laid Preston down for bed. The girls just finished a movie. They watched Scooby-Doo tonight. What'd you girls think of the Scooby-Doo movie? It was sad. Did it have a sad part in it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It I'm not gonna talk about it. Cause when I was inside, I told mom about it and, and that guy started crying. Anyways guys, we had a pretty eventful day today rescuing that hummingbird. That was pretty crazy. And then Trin ended up swimming in the pool with a rat. I don't know if you guys can hear the frog behind me. Listen really quiet. We have a water skipper. Hey, listen. Shh. I can hear it. Anyways guys, make sure you give this video a huge thumbs up. And as always, we will see you guys next time. Bye. Next time Trin. Okay. See you guys later. Bye. <laughs> Saving hummingbird. Bye. Bye. Hope you have fun.